And we want to check in now with Tim White, live at the Democratic Watch Party at the Graduate Hotel in Providence. Tim, what's it like there right now? Well, Shannon, pretty quiet right now. This is the Graduate Hotel, or as most Rhode Islanders know it, the Biltmore. This building has been a bit of a lucky charm for the state Democratic Party over the decades as they fared fairly well in the election. So they generally hold their watch parties here every couple of years. Uh, I'm told by an organizer of tonight's event that the speaking portion will begin shortly after the polls close at 8 o'clock. They're hoping, hoping for victory speeches here. Top of the ticket locally, of course, is U.S. Senator Sheldon Whitehouse. The Democrat is seeking a third six-year term. And while the Democrats consolidate here in the graduate, the Republicans are sort of spread out across Rhode Island. For instance, White House's challenger, Republican Patricia Morgan, is hosting a watch party in West Warwick, and there's a another one in Warwick. You heard earlier from Ted that we expect results, win or lose here in Rhode Island fairly early, but of course a lot of hand-wringing happening inside uh, the Graduate Hotel with a presidential race and importantly, control of Congress. When those are called, who knows? Either way, we'll be here all night bringing you live updates on 12 News and on WPRI.com. I'm Tim White. For now, I'll send it back to the studio.